Hey everybody, I'm just going to give you a heads up. Um, this is going to be a bit of a long video. I apologize for that. However, it is to show you what I have for my little itty bitties. I designed these blankets myself, including the California Rainbow, which is the name for this design. Um, it's unspecified in any pattern. It is something that I came up with myself, so I call it California Rainbow. But yeah. And there's the dinosaurs that I designed. That's a T-Rex. Uh, I forget the name of the spiky... I just call it Spike. Uh, Brontosaurus, which is my favorite. Although this is a sample, so his neck is straight, but I did one where his neck is actually um, turned. I just don't have it. I put it in something for my nephew, and the I think Tyrannosaurus. It's got the three horns. It's just samples. So, anyways, now for my itsy bitsies. You guys have seen them, and I think I showed you their bassinet. That's a pink one. The blue one has a little. And you have purple and white, pink, green and blue, and um, variegated, multicolored. That's what variegated means. And then I have the pillows that are the same way. I showed them to you in the last video of them. Now for this one. I gotta grab them. I am going sorry, I'm going to apologize now. I don't have um I'm not going to pull out every single outfit, but I will show you pieces. Um hold on. Let me just make sure I grab the same shots. Um, those are together, these are together. That's the little dress. That's the jumper. One in one, one boy, one girl. Or actually, no, these are the girls. The jumper and the dress are for the girls. Because the boys I have. And then we have little diapers which each set comes with. I'm not going to take them all out. And we have little booties as well, which again, I'm not going to take them all out. This kind of looks like a baseball cap. I'm going to just put the booties back because I want to make sure that they all stay. And then, boop, boop, okay. And then a bonnet. the booty just fell out of. I'll show you the back. It's easier to see the design on it. And what I did with the bonnets, instead of putting the strings, is I put this little loop and you just slide it over their heads. It fits nicely. Okay, that's the girls. And yes, I need the boys purple, but I'll show you that in a second. Just want to make sure this is closed. I don't need to lose any pieces. I've already done that. If there's a different kind of pattern on the booty, I'll take that out to show you. But for the most part, like, there's the baseball cap with the longer, and there's two of them. That's why it's it looks layered. And I just lost one. Alright, but yeah, there's the baseball cap. And this each, there's two of, so there's the... Um, shirt and the pants are just like the girls panties so they're diapers diapers because they're itsy bitsies they don't actually need diaper changes and if you were to get an actual diaper there wouldn't be any <laughs> alright that's 
one set. I'm gonna put that aside. So what I think I'm gonna do. Bear with me a moment. So that I could just put stuff right back in. Just take everything out now. So I will put that in the bag and make it easier for myself. Now, don't know if I have. All right, I'm going to show you. Put these back. So I'm going to show you the other two. They're christening outfits. There's the girls. It's really, really long. And in the instructions, it said to make one for each of them, but. Um, I thought the tuxedos were cuter for the boys, so I made that. I'll show you that in a second. This is the front and the arms right there. With the little ruffled sleeves. Alright, there's the dress. Now the tuxedo. See the little bow tie? And then you have its little shorts. It's like the other outfit that I just showed you, except it has... Uh, bigger sleeves and a bow tie. And that's all loose stuff. Um, of course, it came with. Hold on, that's the wrong bag. Okay. Uh, the girls, they have panties and. There's the bonnet. Again, I did the same thing with the strap. I don't know if you guys can see it has a little lip right here. Uh, that was done on purpose for the look of the bonnet. And there's two of them as well. And the little hats. They're a little bit different from the baseball caps. Um, but that's them. And of course, booties and panties that I've already shown you guys. I'm going to put that back because that's part of the christening set. So don't mind me for a moment again. I just want to clean up. And by the way, um, I didn't say so in Lily's video, but yesterday was Matthew's 10 month and... Though we didn't do a video celebration, uh, Lily, Matthew, and Cassie, and the whole gang wished Ma Matthew a happy 10 month. Um, and three weeks on Friday, or tomorrow, for Lily. Um, okay, let me just see something. This is nightgown, so this is pajamas. Okay. The girls, I did just a plain pink for one, but the other one, I designed this myself. It's a little nightgown, because they didn't, it, the pattern didn't show any in the book, so I designed a little nightgown for each of the girls, and there was a design for the pants, I think, or no, I, I think what I did for the pants is I copied the pattern for the undies, which is really simple, and then I just, and the boys I have one layer of blue, one layer of green, but I'll show you the variegated one, it's a little t-shirt, and shorties, actually no, I didn't copy it, excuse me, what I did is I made the two little bottom, the legs, and I went around on each one, and then I, instead of cutting off on the second one, I combined the two to make it into legs. Those are their pajamas. Uh, next, they have diapers for each one. So, in each color, there's diapers and booty. Two 
two for each one. And the same goes for the boys. Oh, no, wait, that's not it. Yes. The boys have the same thing. And yes, they're in plastic bags because that's how we decipher the sets on. Maybe I'll do this next. Okay. This is kind of a little bit different. There was a design for sun hats. So there's the hat. And then the little diaper. But there was also a little bathing suit that straps were around the neck. Which I think actually was my design because what I did is I made the diapers design and then I went up in the front. And it's just the right size to cover, by the way. And I'm using a boy to cover, but this is little Charlie. I do not remember all their names at this very moment, but yes, they all have names. Um, I should actually make a hat for the girls, too. I did the same with the other set. There's blue and pink, and then purple and green. That's a summer. Next, I think I should do winter. I don't know. Oh, yeah. This is the same thing. See, these are the color combos for the one pair. It's a boy and a girl. Now I'm going to show you the other. This is a little dress. And yes, there's panties for that too. That's The bottom is pink, and then I did the this blue on the um, edge of it. And then the little hat. That's kind of my design, actually. I don't think they had a, a winter set. They only had um, a kind of a bathing suit where they were wearing their diapers. And the blankets were their towel. Um, but yeah. There's one pair. There's... Uh, and I'm missing a booty for it, but I'm not going to get into that. So for the boys little top and long pants this was actually started from the top and then worked down and then instead of going um, around the whole thing I stopped halfway and then went across and then just went around if you know how to crochet you understand what I'm saying if not I apologize but yeah I, and I did the same thing with the hat on this one and there's booties in here too. Bottom, the foot is um, the foot is red. The ankle to the, um, I mean, the bottom of the foot is red. The rest of the foot is green, and then the ankle is blue. And I don't know where the foot is. I think this is it. I think this is it. This is the other set. See, there's the color combos. If you guys would like to see me dress them up, I will do a video of that. And I'll let you see. I just have to work on the, um, the one little thing for it. The one booty. Okay. The other ones look identical. Um, shoot. How the heck did it undo? Alright, don't mind me. Um, I just gotta fix one of the dresses. Oh, they're both almost the same, it's just that one is mostly pink. I'll show you the detail on it in a second. Alright, now. There it is. It's just the colors are different because it's variegated. Um, it's baby yarn. So it had a lot of yellow on one and a lot of pink on the other one. But yeah, my finger is through the sleeves. There's the front and it's a really, really, really roughly dress. 
And yes, there's panties and booties to go with it. Um, but I cannot close this bag. It does not stay closed for some reason. And that makes me panic because there are little booties in here that could get lost. So don't mind me for a moment while I close the bag on this very carefully because it is tedious and huge and I love these dresses but they are so big um, and the little tuxedos uh, well they call it a sailor suit this is a one piece the same design as the sorry as the other one that I did except it has this this is to help make it easier to dress them and undress them and all I did is add velcro in the back um, but unfortunately it's the annoying velcro that doesn't just stick unless it's to stick to the clothing it's the kind that you actually have to find the stripes on it and push them into place but anyways that's that and oh this is a different kind of hat this is a sailor hat which is why I guess they call it a sailor suit. Yeah, it's got the little piece here, but that's supposed to fold up. I don't know if you guys can see it very well. But again, when it is a little bit darker in here, um, I will do a dress up if you'd like. And... the suit for the boys. Now, hold on a moment while I check something out. There's, there's the dress, there's the panties and the about the boys. Dress, different kind of dress. Hoodies and pants. Okay then. Two girls. All right, panties and booties. You've seen it about seven times already. So, um, this is kind of a dress that can also go with the sailor suit that I just showed you. Because in the the book, they actually do show them together. But yeah, see the little sleeves. And there's ruffle around here that actually doesn't want to stay down. And then instead of a bonnet, it's a little headband. And it actually does show to do this on it, which is what made me decide to do that for all of the bonnets. And I have two of these, but I don't know what I have for the boys. So you have to bear with me. I think I meant them to go together. Oh no! Okay. Never mind. Here's the jumpers for the boys. See? Okay. I did for the girls too on that one, but this is a boys. And of course, booties. Again, you don't need to see all that extra stuff. Keep that off the side. You guys can see that later. Alright, there's a sort of jumper. The bonnet with the booties on. Alright, I'll show you the bonnet on this. It's simple, variegated yarn. Um. Same things. Okay. That's the same thing. There's two of these. Because there's two girls and two boys. But it's a little legless jumper. And short sleeves. I'm really hoping I have it right. Because I'm not sure if I do. But... Oh no, that was for the boys. No, oh, that was for the girls. That was for the girls. 
Ugh. Here it is. Hats. Booties. Boys jumper. Same idea, different colors. And the hat is the baseball hat. Here's another different hat. This is the same as the sun hat. Okay, and then bonnet is the same as the others that I've showed you. Panties and booties are the same. Here's the girl's dress. Here's the boy's jumper. And I think I only made two, one set of that, so that could be the one that goes with the white set that I showed you that only has four, or I think it is, I don't know. I don't know, I have to actually sit and go through the book as well, so. Alright. This is a little bit different. Let me see if I can find more girl stuff. Oh yeah. We did have a lot of stuff for girls in that book, didn't I? Bonnets and booties and panties I'm not going to show you, and I'm not going to show you the extra dress because it's exactly the same color. But Finger through the sleeves again. And there's the dress. That is all of their clothes. I intend on making them holiday things because I have a book, well mostly of holiday dresses. Um, they don't really show many things for the boys, but what I might do is copy the pattern um, in the tuxedo that I did for the christening outfit in the same color as I make the dresses for the girls. That way they have matching and I can say, okay, they're going to dress up alike and I can have all four of them dress alike. So that is their stuff. I apologize for the 23 minute video. Um, and I say 23 minutes because I'm not done yet. I'm going to put them back in their packaging so that they stay together and safe. And yes, this is their bag. So I am going to say goodbye now, and I will see you guys again soon. Hope you liked the video. Bye!